What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Chevy Box Rider, Feather Chevy TV. And we in the lab, y'all. So, this is going to be a little small little video. Give me a second. Catch you back. Southern 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 Chevy TV. Man, I'm so tired of hearing about it. That's all this dude is talking about. Ruby, 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 Ruby. Like this is the bottom. So what you say? Way down in the country. That's me, Sippy, huh? The Southern Chevy TV guy stepped on the punk ass nigga feet. Say what yes. Say? Mad cause he can't get his shit off the ground. Ha ha. All he can do is hate and try to bring another brother down. Damn yeah, man. I guess you realize by not building the car ain't written in stone. Shout it. Nope. It's about perfection. Ha. If it so takes 29 you times to get one time right. That's how you do it, man. That's how you do it, man. But you ain't be one. Ha! ha. You a joke, man. So what you say? But you know, it's all yeah, good, man, it's though. All good. It's Let all them good. haters do their job. That's what they do. Go on and hate. That's what they do. You know how it go. Cause I can bet you a million dollars you ain't got no money for it. Man, you know that clown ain't got, got no Ford rims. Well, if he ain't got no Ford rims, I know that broke ass nigga ain't got no candy paint. That's because his cheap ass can go to spray. Shoulda went to spray way. But he didn't. But he did. That's why shit all fucked up now. But us here, us here at Southern Shaver TV, 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 we're gonna keep pushing, pushing, and pushing, pushing, pushing for perfection. perfection. So what you say? So for this one, it's that time. It's time for me to get it popping. Spray away done hollered at me. Unique G bodies done hollered at me, and they done pumped my head up to do something. So you know what? Time to get rolling either on that car there. Is either we gonna do this one or we gonna do the red one back there. So let me show you what I'm talking about. Let me get the camera turned around. So yeah, YouTube, as you see, fragile liquid, that's for me. So what is all in the box, man? A lot of goodies, so let me show you what. No, also, I want all y'all to get in the comments, man. Tell me which car y'all want to see. See me start working on. Mm -hmm. But as of this, the Colton story, your cam, yes, indeed. So let me get everything out the box and show you what I got going on. So we got everything out the box. And let me show you what we got going on. It's that time. So, with everything on here, y'all know I went up there to the school and I was learning. Y'all thought I wasn't going to do it. Huh? Oh, yeah. So, let's see what all we got. We got a low volume um, pressure gun, which is a pretty good gun. Shout out to uh, Underground Paint King. Told me where to get it from Summit Racing. I want to say this gun was... Uh, $64. I want to say it was $64. Everything that came with it was gun. You know, your um, canister, cleaning things, some extra little filters and attachments. So, we got all that. Also, from Summit Racing, I got a uh, pressure regulator. So, y'all know, in one video, I had showed y'all I had already had door block blocks. Um, never been used. But we gonna get we're gonna get some use out on this go round. So we got that. So if y'all remember on one video with uh sprayway, I had the contour SCT. Good for uh removing paint rust, getting it down. Um I need to get me another wheel because that's the wheel that I have that comes with it. I think on that one I paid I got it on sale. I wanna say it was like 180. So y'all seen me on the video uh, working with that. I'm gonna go back and get, I think it's the 80 grit drum thing. So I'm gonna get that. So moving on, got me a DA, good old Harbor Freight. Let's see, let's get it open. I'm not gonna do no whole review on it or nothing, but just letting you know what all I got to get the job done. So, comes with the disc, everything on it. Uh, bearable speed, as you can see. So, so yeah, you got other, like a little handle, um, a little tool, some extra little that parts if it goes out. Um, Allen wrench, you know, et cetera, et cetera. 
give me one second. Let me put this back in. Right, got it back in now. So this DA cost me. Um, this one was seventy nine dollars. So got that from good old Harbor Freight. Also got me some little spreaders, which I got a few more that I had around here, but. I mean, for what? I think it was two bucks. Why not get, get you some extra ones in case you need it? Went on ahead, got me a whole body kit hammer set, which definitely gonna need that to get them, uh, them highs knocked down and everything like that. Definitely gonna need that. So, here, yeah, let me get it, get it open for you. Get me one. All right, we got it open. As you see, got all your different assortment of hammers. Dolly things, as you can see. So yeah, I'm telling y'all, man, I'm about to, I'm about to really get it cracking up in here, man. My man done showed me how to do everything the right way. And one thing about it with the cars, you know, he's going, uh, he's still gonna paint them. I'm still gonna let spray away spray, but I am gonna do one myself. Let's see how it do. Probably won't be no candy. It'll be base coat, clear coat. But we gonna get in there. So yeah, let me get this back in the box. Got it back in the box. So yeah, good old seven piece uh, Maddox uh, body and fender set. This one cost me I think forty four dollars. So I went on ahead and got that. Um, I already talked to you about that. So also got me some uh, Summit brand little lack of dinner. I want to say that was like. $16 on Summit when I ordered it. Got me some Dolphin Glaze, um, UP0714. Comes with a little activator stuff with it. I think this on Amazon was $16. So, got that. Got the little spot. Uh, uh, let me focus, focus, focus. There we go. Yeah, got the little spot. Uh, get glazing putty. Got some of that. Told you about the blocks. Okay, got my body filter with the little act with the little activator. Came with it. I think that was. Oh man, I'm starting to run. Can't remember the prices on everything. I want to say on that one I paid like twenty dollars. Want to say, but it was on Amazon. So got my onion board with mixing. So shout out to Spurway on telling me what all to get. Got my Dura Gold. Um, let's see, we got 400 grit. Yeah, let me see. Did I get to see that? Uh, yeah, so we got the 400 gear. It. We got the 180. And also we got, what is this one? 80 grit. Which I got some more coming for the DA. It just didn't make it in the mail today. So, but got that. So, which one thing about my cars y'all been seeing, we take them down to bare metal. I think uh, Ruby and Pennywise didn't go down to bare metal, but everything else we're gonna take down to bare metal, bring it back up. So, especially like with this one right here, I'm gonna get back to it, but see what's already on it. I don't even know what's on it. I don't even know what kind of primer it is. So, so when I do it and don't have a reaction, take it down to bare metal. That way, don't even have to fucking worry about it. Same thing with this one over here. Because um, if y'all remember, on the doors, me and Sprayway was having an issue trying to figure out what the hell was on it. Oh, sneak peek. You see the CD in there? Y'all get an idea? But we're going to leave it there. Um, so, we definitely going to take this one down to bare metal. So, we got some nice little spots to do um, to knock this one out. So, oh yeah, look at that right there. You can see that clear as day. So yeah, we gonna, we gonna get rolling. Yeah, we definitely gonna get rolling. So I already know it got dents, dings, uh, T-tops gonna need to be fixed. So I'm gonna attempt to do the same thing Sprayway did on my Monte Carlo that's up there now. I'm gonna try to do it myself down here and just follow, follow his guidelines, man. Can't go wrong. So, that way, if I do go through, get the body work up, y'all see a lot more of these cars getting done. Because y'all see, my shop is full, man. Can't bring nothing else in. So, you know, we still got this money, Carlo, to do, you know, all that. So, 
let me get back to the video because I'll start talking about the cars and get away from what we was really talking about. All right, so then I got my high build problem uh, primer here, the UP61. I got my activator, got my reducers. So, so yeah, man, we got and got my other uh, epoxy activator. So, yeah, man, it's about to go down. Um, got my strainers, got my cups, got some mixing, uh, mixing things. So I got my paperwork, you know, to learn to see how long in between coats, how long the uh, top coat dry, max time, you know, all the information, man. So that's, if you follow the instructions, you can't go wrong. I know us, we don't like to do instructions. We just like to go, but nah, got to uh, follow, follow instructions. So yeah, this was a, just a little light video. Oh, also, I picked me up a, a little small compressor. Oh yeah, you be king. Yeah, I had to go and get me one. So he told me which one to get. You know, that wasn't bad. Um, I just actually caught this one on um, Facebook Market. So I think I only paid like uh, $150 for that. So, you know, got a little small thing. Um, also, I got some, uh, some wrap coming so I could throw you know, like the little tarp wrap over um, some of the cars, cause I'm not, sh I don't think I'm gonna spray inside the booth. If every time I do get ready to spray, I just pull it out here and um, spray it out here, whether it's daytime or night, which probably would be whenever they are not in the gym. So the fumes and the smells don't bother them. So it'd probably be late at night when I spray and then bring it back in, things of that nature. I might give me a little tarp, put me a little tarp tent up, do what I need to do, then go back in. So, and then once it's dry for the night, you know, to the touch, then I just roll it back on in. So that's kind of how I'm setting it. But I know one thing, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go section by section. So this is a fender that we had already started working on, but with this one, I had to go back and look at the videos and see that we never took this one down to bare metal. So we're gonna take it back down to bare metal, bring it back up, but that's gonna be on the next video. This is just the intro video to the series that's about to go at hand. We gonna do it the right way. We ain't gonna skip no, um, no steps. We're gonna do everything and I'm gonna see how close can I get to the teacher. So spray away. I know you're gonna let me know. So. So, so for now, YouTube, this is what I need y'all help with. A lot of y'all don't get in the comments. Get in the comments. Are y'all ready to see this one go? Come up and get everything done? Or do y'all want to see the red one? The other T-top one. So I got decisions. I don't know which one. And y'all know me, honestly. I really want to jump on one of the SS's. And I know my guy, I keep forgetting your name. Man, I keep forgetting your name. I know what you gonna say. Man, get on Ric Flair. Ric Flair coming. Ric Flair is coming. I promise to you, it's coming. I just gotta, just gotta get, man, I took a bad, I took a good blow with that truck. So it's one of them that once you hit that, get that gut check, man, you don't really wanna mess with. So, but I'm, I'm gonna get back on it. So, man, yeah, y'all get in the comments. Let me so, know. Yeah, YouTube. So now, with like with this whiteboard here, I'm gonna call like um, Neat G bodies. Get with Sprayway, um, Underground Paint King, Grind School. Some of y'all guys that been doing it, you know, get some tricks of the trade. Get that knowledge. Write it up here on the uh, board. Also, every little thing that I'm doing, I'm gonna write it down so that way it could be like a little check off list. You know, make sure I went through the process right on everything. That's the main thing. We gonna get this body work right. You know, we ain't gonna cut no corners or nothing. Skip the process. We ain't gonna do none of that. We gonna do it right with doing that. So I know if I hit my guys up, they gonna let me know what's going on. So, you know, at the end of the day, as my boy Swag would say, man, you got a lot of content, man. You need to be shoot, shooting all this stuff. I mean, yeah, I'm coming, you know, gotta remember man in this game youtube you know what i'm saying you gotta play chess 
not checkers, man. So y'all know with me, every time I bring out a video, it's really about doing something. So that's why I just don't put any and everything out. So, but with this, it's, it's gonna be a nice video. I mean, a nice series. Y'all know how I do. A lot of y'all done did a lot of stuff after watching my videos, man. I'm glad I was able to motivate any and everybody to do something. So we gonna keep on rolling with that spirit, man. You know, I'm not necessarily a vlogger or anything like that. I just like to show what I'm working on. If it helps out somebody, cool, you know. But um, man, we, we, we gonna get rolling, man. So y'all definitely let me know in the comments if y'all wanna see me do this Monte Carlo, which some of the pieces is up at Sprayway to this car. So a lot of them that I, I won't be doing, but you know, I could do, you know, the whole engine bay, um, things of that nature, to do the doors, do the roof, quarters, things like that. Or I could just take what Sprayway done already put up and do it myself on this T-top. So I know me, I really want to jump on one of the Impalas, but I'm probably going to save one of the Impalas. And then two, I really want to jump on my Aero Coupe, but shout out to Swag for linking me up with Finesse. And he coming over there letting me know that, hey man, I can knock out your T-tops cause that, that's some work I don't know how to do. You know, I'm not no welder or anything like that, but I'm going to learn, I'm going to learn. So, and then two, Finesse told me he'll show me how to do it. So, you know, you always got to link up with good people, man. So my boy Swag really uh, linked me up with somebody real good that'll take, take time out to show me and I can run up there and get the knowledge from him and his people. You know, his whole camp do it. So, but as y'all can see with this one, yeah, it, it's, it's real ate up bad. It's real ate up bad. So, but you know, you got the whole header panel to go up there. We got to put a floor in it. Um, over here, sitting on top of that wood, if you can see, that's the roof skin that goes right up there. So, yeah, I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, and then, you know, whoa, whoa, likes talking noise. But whoa, oh, you see him. But anyway, you know what I'm saying? We, we doing our thing. We doing our thing. So, all I can say is, man, let's get it. Quit talking about what you're going to do. Just put in the work, man. Just put it, put in the work. You will be surprised when you do something. What you could get, what you get done. Don't second guess yourself. Don't doubt yourself. Just do it. You know, the same way you take something apart is the same way you put it back together. It, it ain't that hard. Cause I knew at one time I didn't know how to do LS swaps, but the Marcus Callaway showed me how to do it. Talked to me on the phone, then boom, I was able to do it. Started putting videos out. It started helping the next guys. And you know, a lot of y'all guys done call me. Ask me different stuff about it. I done helped y'all out, so I was glad I was able to help y'all out. So, you know, Sprayway done took the time to take me under his wing to show me how to do it. So guess what? I'm gonna pass it on. And that's the one thing about the, uh, about life, man. We got to pass this information on. Can't go to the grave with all this information, man. And the next generation don't know how to do. Cause my son don't know how to do all this. So, but yeah, man, definitely, definitely got to get it. So. I'm gonna definitely be cranking out some videos. This is just like I say, the beginning part of the video of the series of me doing some body work, man. So it's coming, y'all stay tuned, and we have.